What's up everybody, welcome to Park Mazda. Today we're gonna to show you how to update your navigation for your Mazda Connect infotainment system. So you'll start by going to www.mazda.ca. From there, you'll click on the Owners tab. And then you'll go down to where it says Mazda Connect. That's going to take you to the Mazda infotainment website. You'll select the year of your vehicle. We're using a 2016 Mazda CX-9 GT for this example. Now once you're on this page, you're going to go to the very top where it says navigation. And you're going to go down to update my maps. Now on this page it's going to show you a whole list of instructions on what to do. It's got instructions for Windows operating system and you've got instructions for Mac OS X operating system. So we'll start at the very beginning. You're going to download the Mazda toolbox for Windows. It'll give you the option to select your language. Make sure this box is selected. Click finish. You'll get to the license agreement. You'll have to read through it before the agree button will let you click. will then ask you to insert your SD card. You'll just insert that into the SD card slot of your computer. The SD card slot containing the nav SD card will be near your USB ports. Sometimes the USB ports will be below the climate control instrument panel or on the CX-9, the one that we're using today, it's inside the center console. You just lift that little tab right there push down on the SD card and slide it right out. And once you've inserted the SD card, it will start reading it. And just note, this process may take several minutes. Now it'll ask you to log in or register an account. If you have your login information, you can enter it right there, or you can register for your account if you don't have one yet. So you enter your first and last name. Follow the instructions all the way. You can sign up for notifications from Mazda regarding maps, exclusive offers, and software updates if you choose to do so. You'll get a validation email sent to your account. So once you go to your email and confirm your registration, you'll get to a page 
where it'll talk about your available updates. It'll ask you to back up your device. Then you'll click install. We'll begin the backup process. And there you have it. Once it downloads and installs properly, you'll get a notification that says your SD card has the latest available map and content, and you can now reinsert the SD card into your vehicle. And that's all there is to it. You can exit the you can exit the toolbox and then you're good to go. Just make sure you create a backup uh, in the very beginning so that if anything happens during the process, you can back up your maps. And once you're done, just pop it back into your vehicle, the SD card back into your vehicle, and you are good to go. So thank you very much for watching this how-to video on updating your navigation for your Mazda Connect infotainment system. For any other how-to tutorials, you can visit us online at parkmazda.ca. You can also check us out on our YouTube channel where we've got a playlist for all of our tutorial videos as well as any news, video blogs, and other information that you might need Mazda related. Please subscribe, share, like us on Facebook, and all that good stuff. So thank you very much again for watching. It's been our pleasure to serve you. We hope to see you soon.